and a lot of subscribers. Okay, so today we're checking out MOA's Checkmate uh, song that just recently came out. It came out, let's see, three days ago, and some of you are very um, anxious about me reacting to MOA. Like, when his song drops, you are like on it when you're <laughs> telling me I should react to it, which is fine, but just uh, remember that I can't react to it the same day or the second day he drops it. I just don't want to, uh, you know, um, take away views from the original. Uh, so three days later I think is fine. Mm, I also cannot possibly film uh, any day, like, <laughs> I still have stuff to do in my day-to-day -day life and stuff like that. So, of course, I won't be able to uh, film stuff uh, whenever something drops because, uh, you know, when something drops, it might be really late in the evening for me and I can't really film late at night. I would love to because that's when my mood is the best, to be honest. I'm a, a night owl because I just enjoy night much more than I enjoy daytime and being awake at night uh, is something I really cherish and appreciate. But I can't because of my parents and because I can't be too loud at night and I, you know, couldn't be as excited as I want to be <laughs> because of my parents sleeping, of course, because, you know, I don't live by myself. But one day when I do, that would be amazing and I'll be able to film whenever I want to and that would be such a huge thing for me. So one day, but not too soon. I don't think so. Okay, let's uh, start recording. We can start recording in 3, 2, 1, go. And let's see how we did with this song. I don't know uh, which genre it is. I hope it's uh, more rap oriented than his last song. I liked his song with Selena. It just, um, it's just too poppy and too mainstream for my taste. But we'll see how this one does. Okay, I'm gonna like this one a bit more, I think, because of the beat. Also, he keeps dropping songs so frequently, so I don't know, he must be working really hard, so that's always commendable. Oh, his hair is getting so long. <laughs> okay, okay, I get it, okay, I get it. Also, I want to say I'm kind of sick, so... <laughs> if you hear me coughing, I'm so sorry. Okay, okay, this song is much, much uh, more my taste and my style than uh, his last song is. This is much more down to earth and much more um, authentic and real in my opinion. It's... Um, Reminds me of his old uh, stuff he used to do. We'll see about the lyrics. Mm. Oh, this beat is really nice. I know some of you guys told me that it's gotten copyrighted by someone, but it's uh, like they both, both use the same sample and um, the guy copyrighted him, which isn't really nice. I don't think so. Uh, why would you copyright him if you both use the same sample? Uh, samples, I don't think, can be copyrighted if they are, you know, paid off. So I don't know. I don't know. That's kind of weird for me. But you guys will probably educate me when it comes to that, um, why he copyrighted him. Mm. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, I guess the, the little uh, is a, a sample that's used, I'm guessing. But that shouldn't be... Um, that shouldn't be something you could copyright. I don't know. YouTube's copyright system is getting out ahead. 
हाँ जेब में था चिल्लर साथ वाले किल्लर काम करे कांड वाले लाइफ बेड़ा थ्रिलर घूमे फिर मस्ती में दिन रात मस्ती में फिर भी काम किया बेटा खड़ा किया फिल्लर चाहने वाले बहुत थोड़े बहुत हेटर उनकी क्या थी वो मेरे नाम से फेमस That is true. A lot of people, I feel like, are hating him for the clout. Uh, I appreciate people who, I mean, not appreciate. I respect people who have some problems with his lyrics or whatever, and are, uh, you know, doing that, uh, like dissing him in, in a normal way, you know, just for dissing him just because they don't like him. But if you're dissing him just to gain clout, that's on you. Like I don't understand that. That's something that always happens to a lot of popular people, and I think he's uh, getting more and more popular. So people are getting people are getting more and more fed up with him. So I get that, but still, you know, if you're gonna hate on him, hate on him for valid reasons, or you know, diss him for valid reasons, I should say, not just for clout. <laughs> he doesn't use a lot of you know females and just he doesn't use a lot of tropes that's severely used in rap music just you know females and um like crews or people like behind him i feel like he always just kind of films himself and that's it and i really enjoy his fashion here as well i think he has a really good fashion <laughs> I think the hook goes really, really hard. I really enjoyed this hook. Oh, my back it was like. Mm. <laughs> okay, so this is like a shot, a direct shot to people who are like. Uh, who were dissing him when it comes to um, him saying he represents hip hop in India right now? And I felt like this was a shot directed to people who said that. And mm. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's doing really, really nice in this song. I appreciate lyrics like this so much more than what he put out in the last song. So if you are gonna, you know, tell me, I know you guys are gonna tell me to react to every single song he drops, but do realize that I like this type of music much more than I do enjoy uh, pop rap music. Um, just mixing of those two genres can be great, but if it doesn't have lyrical substance, I'm not the biggest fan, you know. <laughs> Nice. Oh, I like this so much. This hook is so catchy. I think he's really good when it comes to hooks. And I really prefer him by himself with no features. I love Selena, but I prefer him because he gets to shine more when he's by himself and he gets to write more verses and I think his hooks are better than um, than uh, just you know having someone else on the hook in my opinion mm. <laughs> I really like that mm. his clothing is so Immaculate. I don't usually see people wear clothing like his, so I'm really like impressed by his, him, like just his fashion sets in general. It's so good. Also, I'm losing my voice. <laughs> oh, I liked it. 
I really like the, the, the video, the visuals in this one. Really interesting. I really like all the edits. Whoever edited this video probably took him such a long time to edit this, I feel like. Okay, let me just see who uh, copyright claimed him. Um, kill him. Let me see song killer. Uh, icon music. Hmm. I oh, can't really find it. Never mind. I'm gonna look for it afterwards. Just want to see if it's that similar or if it's that same set sample. Um. Still bad when he got claimed because that means he can't make money off this song and that's really sad because he must have put so much effort and thought into this and the video is so nicely edited. Let me see who edited it. Nishan. Okay, he did such a wonderful job and whenever he does a song I feel like he invests invests his time the best way he can when it comes to visuals it's always amazing when it comes to beats i think he always chooses good ones um i just feel sad that he got claimed because uh you know he could have made so much money off of this that's very sad i hope he resolves it like i hope he disputes it maybe because even if it's like um sample i don't think it should be copyrighted by the person who also did the sample i can't really find the song that claimed his video so i don't know if it's that similar you guys will probably tell me but if it's just a sample then it shouldn't be claimed by a person who also used the sample that's what i heard that both of them used the sample and that one made a song slightly before i'm away and that's why it was claimed so if it's that, I mean, we please do fight this because <laughs> um, copyright claims are getting ridiculous when it comes to YouTube. Um, not just for reaction channels, but just for people in general. They they are having their like whole videos claimed just for using five seconds of some songs. So just please fight that. <laughs> hopefully, like because why not? You should be making the money from your own song that you wrote and that you made and uh, the video as well. So I'm just saying on that. But I really enjoyed this song. I think it was really nicely put together. It's really, really catchy. The hook is amazing. I feel like it's really good at writing hooks. And the verses are also very creative. And I like the shots he was, uh, you know, subliminally um, sending uh, to everyone who dissed him. Um, but he still hasn't responded, so I don't think he will respond, to be honest. I don't think he will. I think he will take the higher ground and just, um, you know, just continue making music and sometimes, you know, just send a bit of shots in <laughs> videos. I don't think he will make a full-fledged this to anyone because I do think he believes, um, you know, he is beyond that. Uh, I mean, that is, you know, you can think however you want of that. To me, um, I thought he should have maybe responded at least something, you know. Um, but then the beef would continue forever, I feel like, because I don't think any of them would let him go. So I feel like the beef would continue. Um, so I think maybe he chose to let it go just because he didn't want it to continue forever and he wanted people to focus more on his music than beefs, which is smart thing to do. I think he really did this smartly and I really, really like this song. I think it uh, gives me some vibes of his older stuff that I really, really enjoyed uh, recently. I liked his new stuff as well, uh, like you guys know, but um, when it comes to his real bangers, I feel like those were... Um, you know, Manche and stuff like that are stuff that's a bit older. So I hope uh, to see him, you know, um, make more music that's like his old stuff, but also um, to innovate them more, you know, to um, take care of lyrics more and to, you know, just grow as an artist like he continues to do. So I really wish him nothing but the best and I cannot wait to see him more. Uh, but I hope he doesn't make too much music, you know, because he might get a burnout, you know, 
when it comes to writing lyrics and stuff, I think he should take it a bit slower because I feel like he's been dropping so many stuff recently that it's just insane. But anyways, I really, really enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed my reaction as well. Please do realize I cannot drop uh, stuff as soon as it drops because I just... First of all, I don't want to do that because of the artist. Second of all, I cannot physically do that because I have to prepare the days I film, you know. And yeah, I just, just hope you, uh, you know, realize that. And I hope you don't think that I'm too harsh on you when I say stuff like that. That it's just me uh, teaching you to be patient when it comes to stuff. Um, just reaction channels in general. I feel like you should be patient because they get a lot of lot of requests. And it's same with me. But I try my best to, you know, still provide you with what you want. Maybe just a day or two later. And yeah. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed. Love you guys so, so much. I missed you. And even though I'm sick, I'm today filming a few videos, six or seven. Some of them are requests. Some of them I want to check out on my own. Um, I'm having like a terrible cough. It's like terrible, terrible. I had a fever and I had a virus. Uh, I caught a virus from, um, from <laughs> being a job and they turned on the uh, air conditioning like cooling and I got a severe <clears throat> throat like just infection so uh, that's what happened and why I'm sick uh, and yeah anyways I decided that job is really not for me because of some like crazy stuff that I might talk about one day but I'm not sure so yeah <laughs> hope you enjoyed love you guys so much we'll see you very soon next one I love you bye